Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Ryan. If you are new here, welcome back if you are not. If you are new here, like I said, my name is Ryan. I post lifestyle, fashion, beauty, theater, and Los Angeles content here on YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok. I'm also the co-host of 20 Whatever Podcast, where we talk about all things 20s, different phases of life, and how to maintain friendships and relationships in your 20s. Today I'm doing kind of an old school style YouTube video where I will be sharing with you some of my current favorites. This was a suggested video that I do while I am preparing for Legally Blonde the musical. I'm currently in a production of Legally Blonde here in LA and so a lot of my time is spent doing that and if you're interested in theater content I have a whole playlist of theater vlogs and Legally Blonde vlogs for you to check out. But before we get into our first favorite I'll have everything that I talk about in today's video linked down below and pin a comment as well. Okay, so the first favorite on this list is an obvious one. It's a new addition to my room, and that is my vanity. So I wanna say a huge thank you to Hernis for working with me on this video. This is not a sponsored video, but they did gift me this vanity. It's actually been a few weeks since I have had the vanity and used it, and I absolutely love it. So let's roll the footage to when I unbox the vanity, put everything together, organized it, and showed you guys the finished product. Just. So I'm actually putting a vanity right here. I know that I kind of talked about like a long time ago in a random blog that I wanted to try to figure out a situation over here that just made a little bit more sense. I had these blocks here and I like it for storage, but it really was just like holding things. It really wasn't that functional. Um, and I really hate doing my makeup at my desk because I just feel like there's so much shit everywhere and I have like my laptop and my computer and all my work stuff on the desk and I just don't, and I have to move it every time. So that's why I end up doing my makeup on the standing desk, which is fine. And I do like to do that and I'll probably continue to do that sometimes. But my other issue that I've been having is that I don't have a lot of storage for makeup, skincare, even if I have like backup products, like anything like that, lotion, etc. I just kind of have my stuff everywhere. And so I really wanted to have a dedicated space for all of my like beauty products, if you will. Hernis actually reached out to me and asked if I wanted to pick up some pieces for my room. And I was like, I'm literally looking for a vanity, but I have a small space. So, you know, I can't be out here like with a grand big ass like mirror and like doing the most and they actually had this super cute perfect for small spaces mirror vanity with an led light built-in storage and a built-in stool and i was like perfect because that was the other thing too i was like damn if i get a vanity i'm gonna need to figure out a chair and i guess i could just move this one back and forth which i hate this chair i haven't talked about it my current desk chair you've seen it here if you've never seen it there it is. I hate it. It really hurts my back. It's cute aesthetically. It's really not good for somebody who is sitting at their desk for so many hours a day. So do not recommend. That's not what this is about. Anyway, point is it has a built-in stool and I'm just like, right. Also, I look not good, but you know what? It's a Thursday morning and it's just fine. It's been a long week. Okay. 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 She has arrived and that's what men are for. Here she is, low key. Should I put this on its side? The website, all the reviews said there was like basically no assembly necessary, so I hope that's true. Yeah, I'm gonna need to turn it on its side because this it the box is upside down. I need to be really careful. Okay, slay. Oh, maybe I should turn it up on this side and then try to pull the box up. Oh, 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 O'Reilly's oh, Auto Parts. Bow! Okay, lift with your knees, Ryan. Lift with your knees. Where do I grab it? Uh, I actually don't know if I can do that. So. Maybe we cut the box. This is so heavy. Like, I don't even know how I'm gonna get it to stand up and there would have been literally no way for me to stand this up or for me to get this up the stairs, no way. All I need it to do is stand straight up. That's all I need to happen here and then I'm good, and then I'm literally good. Like, it's put together. It is literally assembled. We got it. We did it! Woo! Now I'm so hot. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. Great. Now, now it's on wheels, so all I have to do is push it. So we have one, two, this is the chair, third drawer, ouch, fourth drawer. Yay, we did it. It just looks like a little set of drawers right there. This isn't too weird. Feels good just sitting here like this. Okay, Paloma thinks that it should go catty corner, and honestly, I kind of agree. So I'm gonna move this, and then I think I'm gonna start putting stuff in it. Wait, what time is it? <gasps> Slay. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Oh my God. I love it. I love it. I guess it's time to start filling her up and decorating her and, and trying to fit everything in these drawers. This lighting is everything. New angle unlocked. I could put a little tripod right here. I could put one right here. Oh, I could put one right in front of me. So if you're interested in checking out this vanity or anything else on the Harness website, be sure to click the link below and use my code CHR15 for 15% off your purchase from Harness.com. Okay, next favorite that I have, I'm actually wearing and it is this necklace. I'm so obsessed with the gold charm jewelry that is trending right now. It's so like 90s, early 2000s, which is like the era that I grew up in, and it just reminds me of the juicy charm bracelets. Please, those are relics. I would definitely save up to get a juicy vintage charm bracelet for sure, but I actually ended up getting this one at a little boutique store in Eagle Rock called Haley Solar or Haley Solar, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it's just a little tiny boutique shop that my friend and I just like walked into after brunch and we walked in and they gave us a glass of wine and they were like, please shop. And I was like, ooh, you guys are good. Give me a little drinky drink so I can spend some money. Sneaky, it worked. I saw this and I was like, well, I have to have it. So I got this necklace. I. I am so obsessed with it. I love the detail. I love the individual charms. I think my favorite one is the balloon dog. It's so cute. I also love the color of gold that the necklace is. It just is so rich and like looks so expensive and I'm just so obsessed with it. So I will have their Instagram linked down below. My next favorite is a makeup product and it is the Merit Beauty Day Glow Highlighting Balm in the shade Solstice. I have been using this every time I don't wear any makeup. I will do, I'm also gonna film this, I think, like my 30 second makeup routine, cause it's literally 30 seconds, but I always use this. I do it wherever I normally would put highlighter, like dab it on, wipe it on, all over the high points of my face. Use my finger to dab it out and it looks so good. The glow, it literally looks like glow from within. I think because it's not powder, it really is just able to like sit in with my moisturizer and just shine through. I've really, really been loving this. It really goes well with my skin. They have a few, I think they have three or four shades. I also think I have a code with them. I'm not positive. If I do, I'll have it somewhere on screen and in the description below. Okay, so moving on into the internet space, I wanna talk about a few creators that I've been loving right now. I'm loving this creator named Was Good on Instagram, and I am just obsessed with the way that they put together their outfits, their fashion, even just like the feed itself is so aesthetically pleasing to me. I love all the bold colors and the mismatching fabrics and patterns. Like, I'm really, really inspired by this account. It's so artistic and beautiful, and I love, love, love this page. Another creator that I've been loving on YouTube for my ASMR girls out there, I've been watching Deja ASMR. She gives me the tingles like no other like her clickety clacks and just it's so good she does a lot of like hair brushing videos and like hair mannequin hair wig stuff it's so good so relaxing the colors that she has in her videos it's just so nice another creator on youtube that i've been watching that i've actually been a little bit inspired by is francis ray she posts like kind of 
cinematic artistic videos but her focus is on gardening content um and her life like in LA and stuff and so I I really really like the vibe that she has and it's just like she's a very like sweet and like calming presence and also really funny because she'll just be gardening and honestly I watch her when I garden so it's just extra entertaining for me um it kind of just feels like I'm hanging out with a friend but I've really been liking her content a lot she hasn't posted in a month so Francis Ray if you're watching this please post a video miss you illy <laughs> Okay, the next thing on my favorites is something I'm also wearing and it is this jumpsuit. I actually rented this from Newly and ended up purchasing it because I loved it that much. This is the Reverse Sweetheart Wire Jumpsuit in Black from Susanna Monaco. I don't know the brand at all, but I see them on Newly. They have a ton of stuff on Newly. The quality of this jumpsuit is incredible. When I think about how I want to style this for summer, even though it is black and has like pant legs, I feel like this is the perfect rooftop dinner situation for a late night when it's 85 degrees out at 10 p.m. and I'm on a rooftop like this is just very sleek and sexy I love the midsection with a little bit of under boob hanging out like it is just so classy but also incredibly sexy to me it fits like a glove if you're a long-legged girly I'm five eight and a half these pant legs are perfectly fit for me I feel like I'm kind of in between sizes right now. I'm in between a medium and a large, and I got this in a large and it's perfect. However, I will say that if I were to wear this out on a night that I was gonna be drinking a little bit, I probably would put some fashion tape just to keep it down. My nips are not gonna pop out, but I do think that at some point it would be more under boob than I'm interested in, you know? So I would put fashion tape just to secure it, but I've also worn it without tape and been so fine. So use your judgment, you know, you'll be able to feel it out um, depending on what your girls are giving. But I absolutely love this jumpsuit and I'm really, really glad that I purchased it because I think I'm gonna be able to wear this for many seasons and for a long time. So I love her. Okay, two more favorites. My next favorite is a song. It's a song I can't get out of my head. I've been literally singing it every day and it's Next To You by Kehlani. First of all, Kehlani, Kehlani, if you're watching this, hey. <laughs> I love Kehlani. I have loved Kehlani since I was a teenager and I first discovered her. She has been a staple and a part of my life for a really long time. She has an incredible voice. She's so talented. She's so hot. She's also an activist and has been for so long and has been so loud and proud about what she believes in, about what's right. And I just admire that in a celebrity and in an artist because a lot of them ain't speaking out and they really just should and they're not and she is. It's just so awesome to see as famous as her still cares about people and cares that there is an entire, I'm trying to use my words wisely because YouTube has been censoring a lot of stuff. So I'm not gonna use a lot of words, but she supports the Watermelon Land so much and so do I. She's an artist that I can like fully support and they believe that everybody deserves rights and everybody can be saved and everybody should be free and that is who I wanna support. So with that, her song Next To You is not only a bop, but 100% of the proceeds from the merch of that song go to families in Pakistan, Congo, and Sudan with Operation Olive Branch. I'll have Operation Olive Branch and a bunch of other resources linked down below as much as I can without getting censored of ways that you can support, whether that's financially donating to a family, sharing an infographic, reading up on stuff, all of that is important and it is helpful. And like I said, I'll have all of the resources as much as I can linked down below for you guys to check out. And with that, the last thing I have is actually a gift from my mom. She gave it to me for my birthday, but I wasn't able to see her until a few weeks after that. She custom made me these Nikes that actually also have my name on them. They're this gorgeous light green color with like a moss foresty green accent with brown soles. My mom knows how much I love sneakers, how much I love Nikes in general, and she also knows how much I love green. That girl, it's like she's a fan. <laughs> also leave a link to how you can customize your own shoes and how she did it, I'll actually ask her. I feel like the colorway of this shoe can definitely be worn year round, which I love and was gonna do regardless. <laughs> So yeah, those are my current favorites. I truly am loving everything that I mentioned in this video. Like I said earlier, I'll have everything linked down below if you're interested. Some of the links are affiliate links, which just means that I will earn 
a small commission from them if you use the link. It's no extra charge to you. You also don't have to use the link. You can Google it and click find your own links and purchase it that way as well. I wanna thank Hernan so much for gifting me this gorgeous vanity and working with me on today's video. This video is not sponsored, but they did kindly gift it to me, so I wanna give a huge shout out to them. Be sure to click the link below and use code CHR15 for 15% off your purchase at Hernan's. Make sure you subscribe, like this video. We are on the road to 10K, so it means so much when you guys subscribe. I appreciate you so much. Follow me on TikTok and Instagram if you would like. Subscribe to the podcast, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.